Hi, I'm here with Roy Nelson with Ball Aerospace, and uh, they've got some pretty disruptive technology in that they've been able to create real-time 3D models using their flash LiDAR system. But I'm going to turn it over to Roy to describe the, the process and what the technology is about. Thanks, Art. As you said, what we have here is a real-time, full-motion, 3D color imaging system. It's a flash LiDAR system where we illuminate an area on the ground and our sensor, every pixel in the sensor provides range information. In parallel with that, in real time, we fuse context imagery to that range point. So what you see here is our basic real-time product, full color LiDAR. Why this is so unique and so applicable is the real-time nature. All the processing we do is done on a per-frame basis, so even before the next frame is taken, we will have processed all that data and made it available to the user. We've done this at night with the infrared fusing, we've done it with SWIR, we've also fused vis imagery to the, to the sensor system. And everything can be tied to Google Earth, we provide a KML file, people can access that data in real time to find out what they're interested in. An example being the Elish's Garden down in downtown Denver, it's single flyover, so one flyover you get this full 3D imagery. Other key discriminators on this is, as I mentioned, you get the color embedded in the point cloud. It's not layered on after the fact, so it's full motion, 3D imagery. It's 100% compatible with any third-party software, and it's platform agnostic. We put it on fixed wing, rotary wing. We're looking at putting it on UAVs right now. Seven and a half pound payload requirement on the Scan Eagle. That's our next objective, repackaging this hardware into a very small system. We've also looked at putting it on other systems like the integrator, one step up, much more flexible platform, bigger power capability, and this system is ready to be provided to the end user right now. Good. Thank you very much, Roy. Appreciate it. Thank you.